Hello, good morning. I'm Oz. I'm the founder of Sunmetrics. Uh, we designed a try-before-you-buy test drive experience for solar power. Today, for every homeowner with solar panels, there are 99 who do not. And it's those homeowners that you're targeting. We'd like to help them transition to solar easier. Talking to installers and talking to homeowners, we realize that one of the biggest challenges today in the industry is customer acquisition. Homeowners don't really know if solar is right for them, if it's actually going to help them save money. On the other hand, we have installers who are spending time, tons of time and money trying to qualify sales leads. With our test drive functionality, homeowners will essentially be pre-qualifying themselves. You go to the Apple store before you buy your, your, your Mac Air or your iPads. You test drive a car before you buy. So why not for solar power? With Sunmetrics Go, homeowners now have that option exactly, and they can do so without spending a single dollar. But what does it really mean to test drive solar energy? It means seeing for yourself if you can actually save money by switching to solar. Most homeowners don't have the answer to that question, so they're leaving money on the table. And I'm going to show you how much in just a few moments. But, but first, just a few highlights about our technology. Our technology is based on satellite images and our own atmospheric models. What this means is that we can cover a huge geographical area and scale this up at minimal cost. For many applications out there, the missing piece of the puzzle is consumption information. For that, we use the green button standard and we get the information directly from the utilities of our users. This is simply the most accurate and detailed consumption information that's available today. And this is where the magic happens, at the hourly scale. The ability to have solar, expected solar production information overlaid with consumption information enables us to estimate the solar savings in the most accurate way. And obviously we can scale this up on a monthly and annual basis. But enough, enough of talking about, about this, let's see how this actually works. My co-founder Simon will now take us for a test drive. code or an address. We choose it here. We can uh, zoom in and make sure we've picked the right location. Then we click on go. All right, now I can customize my home. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> I can spell. I can give it a name and then I can customize the characteristics so it best reflects the characteristics of my actual home by changing the slope of the roof by choosing the number of solar panels for the system size that I want, in this case, a five kilowatt system, by orienting the panels so that they face the correct dire direction, excuse me, and by estimating the level of shade. All right, my solar home is designed. Now I need to give a bit of information about my electricity consumption. I can do that in one of three ways, by using the energy uh, calculator here, and choosing the appliances I use on a regular basis. Uh, or I can input it manually directly from my utility bill. But better still, because I have access to green button data, I can upload my consumption file directly. All right, now the one-time setup is complete. I click on the fin finish button and let Sunmetrics crunch the numbers for you. This takes a few moments, so while the site is uh, being prepared, we'll pitch our business model to you. Thank you, Simon. Um, as, as I mentioned, our target users are homeowners, the 99% who currently do not have any solar panels. We'd like to reach as many of them as possible. That's why we're making Sunmetrics Go available for free. So how do we plan on making money? We have three main uh, revenue streams, a cashback rebate program with installers, a sponsorship program with manufacturers, and a referral fee pro program with financial institutions. We'll start commercialization in Southern California with the cashback rebate program with installers. Now, this program, we're going to market this program to the installers as a no upfront cost, risk-free way to acquire customers. The cashback is only paid to the, to the consumer once the installation is complete, at which point we also get our portion of the cashback. Essentially, we eat when the installers eat. Um, and the rebates can be customized by location. The uh, other th important thing about this revenue model is that it's, uh, 
it's, it's transaction-based, it's been used time and again in other industries, and it's fully scalable. I'd like to take a moment to talk about the Sun Metrics advantage. We're better than our competition for many reasons, as you can see on this table. But I'm going to highlight one key one. We provide a simple, easy to use, and enjoyable experience to the homeowners in which they feel in control. They feel like they can take their time, look at the numbers, see if solar works for, for their particular situation, and then get in touch with the installers when they feel ready. Now, who's the team behind Sun Metrics? This is my amazing team. We've been together for about 17 years now, first as students and then through a previous startup. Uh, we have complementary skills. We cover business, technical aspects. And uh, prior to Sunmetrics Go, we worked in another product called Sunmetrics Track, which was for the B2B market. That helped us mature our technology. And then we realized that there's this huge opportunity on the consumer side. And that's why we're doing a bit of a pivot uh, with this particular product. In our physical presence in Southern California, it's only natural that we'll start commercialization there. Uh, so now let's see if our site is ready. Let's uh, check out the results of the test drive. Now, um, one of the key pieces of information on our dashboard is the total savings that this homeowner could have achieved over the course of the last 12 months uh, if they had solar panels. Uh, remember that when I mentioned the money that's left on the, on the table, it's right there for a five kilowatt average sized system. Uh, and this is the power of hourly data, we're, because we're taking into account things like time of use pricing, which is something that you simply cannot do if you only had uh, monthly averages or average utility rates. If I want to see what happened at a more recent time scale, for example, yesterday, I can do that. And if I want to see what this all means in dollar terms, with the simple switch of a button, I can, I can see my dollar savings hour by hour. Uh, obviously, we don't think that most homeowner, homeowners will be looking hour by hour what happened uh, throughout the year, but they will be interested in the return on investment. They will be interested in the payback period. For that, they will simply click on the buy or lease calculator, and they will be able to see under different financing scenarios what the payback period looks like. Unfortunately, I don't have the time to show that to you. Um, but perhaps the most important piece of the dashboard is that button, find an installer. When the homeowners feel ready and convinced that solar is good for them, with the simple click of a button, they will see the uh, installers in their area, the reviews that these installers got from other homeowners, and best of all, the Sunmetrics cashback rebate that the installers are willing to offer to them. We had a great time building this product. It's up and running. So we really hope that you will take it for a test drive today. Thank you for your attention. Uh, so first off, I think you guys get huge props for doing a live demo. Yep. Uh, that Thank was you. great. Thank you. Thought, really impressive, and and a, and a great demo. A very impressive Thank product. You. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it appeared to work. Um, can you double back on the the rebate dollars there and just explain exactly how that model works because that's obviously critical to making money. Sure, obviously. Uh, the way this is going to work is uh, when, again, the installers see those savings accumulate, they will want to get in touch with the installers. We think that changing human behavior is not easy, but uh, financial incentives go a long way towards achieving that. So as a consumer, if you see that in your region, um, there's, for example, two installers, one of them with a five-star rating, one of them with a four-star rating, but the four-star rating is willing to offer you the highest rebate, you may actually opt to work for that other installer. So it's just a cashback discount that you would negotiate directly with each of the installers? Uh, the no, we, we do not negotiate with the installers. It's a bidding system. Uh, installers see what kind of rebates are offered in their own area, and they decide how much they're willing to offer. So it's, it's their marketing dollars. They spend it uh, the way they, 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 uh, they see fit. Uh, and again, our, our portion, our revenue comes from a portion of those uh, cashback uh, revenues. And uh, the, the evolving house, the house that you've seen, is, uh, is up for sponsorship. So if uh, any of you equipment, equipment manufacturers uh, are interested in sponsoring it, please come talk to us. <laughs> That's great. Any other questions? So how does the founding team know about this problem? Maybe you can elaborate a little bit more about your background, your connection specifically to the end consumer. Absolutely. Installers. I will pass this question today because he just ran a survey um, asking homeowners that question. The, 
I'm sorry, could you, I could barely hear you. Could you repeat the part, first part of the question? Yeah, you know, how, how, how do you know uh, about the problem specifically, other than like interviews, what's your connection, the founding team, to uh, the problem specifically as it relates to the end consumer and installers? Gotcha, okay, so uh, as Oz mentioned, we started in the B2B market, so that was where the, the, the initial uh, understanding of what people were looking for as far as the final dollar and uh, amount of what they can say uh, reared its head. And then once we started doing, uh, uh, questioning consumers, uh, actual homeowners, we did a, a beta test uh, just last week as well as some interviews, and that was uh, a huge issue, is it seems to be an information overload for homeowners uh, when they first start looking into solar, and none of it makes sense. So we tried to make this extremely easy for the homeowner to uh, get information and also provide the information in a very simple format so they can understand the bottom line. So does that answer your question? Yeah, that, uh, maybe you can uh, go into just your, your go-to-market strategy as it relates to installers, how, how maybe your relationships uh, they're going to enable you to move forward with that. Excellent. The, uh, we will just be reaching out to the installers at first to uh, explain the cashback program so we'll, and uh, you know, give them the opportunity to understand the bidding process, and we believe that they'll see the value in that right away, uh, first of all, because they don't have to pay anything until they actually sign the contract, and ideally, including the cashback and our cut, it should still be significantly lower than what they're paying if they have to add up all the, the, the what, 25, we've heard different figures between $2,000 and $3,500 per customer acquisition. Do you have any further comments on that? No, thank you. That was it. Is the um, application entirely web-based? Um, so some, we find this by typing into Google, um, I'm looking for solar energy and they find you? Talk, talk a little bit about that. Uh, yes, it's entirely web-based, and it's uh, platform agnostic. That's something I learned uh, here, uh, which means it works on all mobile devices. Um, the, the way we bring traffic to the website is uh, uh, primarily organic, and uh, we've been experimenting a lot. We spent a whole last year uh, developing the content, the e-books, things that actually drive consumers to the website. But obviously, that's not enough. Uh, we'll be investing in uh, keyboard advertising, uh, social media campaigns, as well as local events in Southern California to really build up the brand. Does that answer your question? Thank you guys very much. Thank you. Excellent. Thank you. Thank you.